can't get enough of it. If you find your finances getting a bit out of hand, perhaps your money mindset is in need of a refresh. This is, uh, I think we could all use a little bit of this right yeah. now. To explain is Transformation Coach, author, speaker, and CEO of Consciously Creating Your Life Incorporated. That's Janine Macklin. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? Doing Welcome. very well. Great. Money, what is a money mindset? Oh, great. So the money mindset is how we actually look at our money, how we think about it, how we feel about it, the thoughts that we have about it. And that then determines what we do, how we budget it, and how we spend it. Absolutely. Uh, what, wh how, how is that? I'm assuming that money mindset's kind of developed at a young age. You, you yes. see your parents and how their money mindset is, and you just yes. kind of pick up on that. Right. It's, we're soaked in it from yeah. our childhood. What we see, how our family handles money, disputes about money, whether you have enough or you don't have enough. It impacts whether you think there's uh, like a scarcity consciousness or if you think there's more than enough. Yeah. Yeah. So it does impact us from an early age. So it's something you want to be conscious of, like what makes up your perception, uh, yes. it, because it affects your relationship with money your whole life? It does, because unless you've changed it or unblocked it or updated the, the beliefs, then you're still really operating on those childhood beliefs. Mm. And they show up in your relationships and your relationship with money that most people don't think they have. Absolutely. Mm. So yeah. let's, let's break some of these preconceived <laughs> notions that we have and get ourselves on the right track. How do you shift mm. your money mindset to something that's more healthy and more positive? Well, you know, there's affirmations you can do. There's budgets that I talk to people about. But what I really like to do is walk my clients through a four-step process. Mm -hmm. And it's an acronym called MIND, M-I-N-D. Mm -hmm. And M is to meditate on what it is that you want. And I really just want you to get clear about what it is you want and how come you want it. What's it going to mean in your life? I negate the circumstance. Excuse me. I is to... I can't remember what the is for. <laughs> <laughs> ignore the ignore the circumstances. Ignore them. The past doesn't have to impact your present, gotcha. and yes. your present really can't impact your future. So I need to say, focus on where you're going. In is for you to negate the negativity, that mm -hmm. chatter we have inside about oh, I can't do it, I'm not good enough, I can't afford that. Shut it down. The last one is design an incredible plan to move from being stuck and stagnant to taking action, mm. or if you're at a certain level, to upgrade your level. And that's what I help people do. Absolutely. Mm. It's power of positive thinking. If you, if you put it out there into the universe that I, you, know, you want to be in this healthy spot, you can have that. You can, yeah. it, but you have to be consistent because statistics shows us it only takes 21 days to change a habit. Of course. Mm. But for this, I found in my years, 20 years of coaching, it'll take a little bit longer because your family embedded values, your family embedded views, if you haven't looked at those or updated them, they're still going to be impacting your money now. Janine, I'm really intrigued by this whole conversation. This is this is really neat. Can you give me an example of what a, a positive mindset would be just on something really specific? With a, money. A positive mindset would be, a lot of times we look at things and say, oh, I can't afford this, or I can't have that. Mm -hmm. When yep. in reality, you can afford anything you really want. You can okay. really afford it. You may not want it at that point. You may not have budgeted for it at that point. Yeah. So if you can really allow yourself to say, I could have it. I just don't want it right now. Or I can have it. It's not in my budget right now. But to move uh -huh. away from eliminating any possibilities of all the various things you could really have in your life. Yeah. You just have to aim yourself towards that and reach that goal. Set that goal, stay focused on mm -hmm. it, and be consistent, and work with someone around shifting your mindset, shifting your limiting beliefs, and shifting your thoughts. Absolutely. You, have, you brought a book on with you. I what did yeah. bring a book on with me. Let's Get You Happy First. It's the last book. This is my second book, Four Steps to Get You to Your Happy. It's on Amazon, mm -hmm. and it really oh, walks great. you through understanding four steps that you can take to move into a happy place in your life. That's fantastic. Uh, yes. You also have a, an interesting offer today for our viewers and it has to do with an audio. It does. Tell so us what that is. They'll go to the website, mm -hmm. www.upgradeyourmoneymindset.com, mm -hmm. and there they'll get an audio. And I walk them through talking about your mindset, your sabotaging beliefs, how you're, what you grew up with, how that still impacts you right now with your decisions about money, yeah. how you spend it, how you save it, and how you share it. So I think it's a wonderful, incredible gift. It's one of my five-step programs. So I'm just pulling out a program to give them an audio to listen to. That's fantastic, and it's a great uh, way to get people on the right track. Yes. Uh, we have about 45 seconds left. I think it's worth noting. Americans have a very complicated relationship with money, it seems like. Yes, we really do. Yeah. Yeah, and no one really looks at it. You know, there's so much around if you're poor and what that means, if yeah. you're wealthy, what that means. There's a lot of conversations now about it. And so it really becomes important to know and identify what your mindset is, what you really think about money, and mm -hmm. then shift it if you need to so you can see greater results, greater income, and just greater peace so you're not stressing so much. Some there's people are too stressing. much stress out there, for sure. You know, some, some people have a plenty of money and feel guilty about that. That is true. There are all sorts of mindsets. So Interesting. many mindsets.
mindsets great. around what's happening with hmm. money. It's great so having you. Yeah. Janine, thank well, you so thank much. You. Thanks for having me thank on you. here. Pleasure. I appreciate it. Get your financial future on the right path. To learn more about Transformation Coach Janine Macklin, visit the website or call the number on your screen. She's also on Facebook and Twitter and Consciously Creating Your Life Incorporated is a proud sponsor of The Morning Blend.